walk away with my crown. Live from Trinidad and Tobago, the 48th annual Miss Universe pageant. Philippines got a lesson on South America from a delegate from Guatemala. Hello. Hello, Jack. So now, I understand that you love to sing and dance in the Philippines. Did you learn any Guatemalan songs? I did not learn any Guatemalan songs because most Guatemalans, uh, Guatemalan music are mostly instrumental. I learned about their uh, instrument, though, which is called marimba. It's like a xylophone. And um, it has, they also named marimba as a dance in the in Guatemala. So it's also an instrument and a dance. And a dance. I see. Now, you say that women are very modest in the Philippines. How would they compare to the women in Guatemala? Are they also very modest? Well, basically, we have the same uh, culture as in Guatemala because we both have been colonized by the Spaniards. And uh, basically, we are both conservative when it comes to, uh, to how women carry themselves. Right, I see. I know something about you that you like to watch TV, don't you? Yes. Okay, now, what, what do you think you'd see in Guatemala if you were watching TV? Oh, if I would be watching TV, maybe perhaps they would have a Discovery Channel there. And if if Discovery Channel would feature Guatemala, I would like to learn more about Guatemala. I love that channel and the lions. I love all that. <laughs> yeah. okay. Philippines, thank, thank you. you. of the Philippines is 23 and a licensed physical therapist who creates special exercises for her patients. She wants to go for a doctorate in physical therapy in order to own and operate her own clinic. Her only regret is that her work schedule cuts into her exercise routine. The fifth position at halfway through the Philippines. Therapist who plans to seek a PhD and dreams of launching her own clinic. finalists in random order South Africa Venezuela Botswana achievements was standing up to one of your professors back in college. Now, what have you stood up for recently? Oh, when I fell on the stage last Friday. <laughs> I believe that I have stood up for the rest of the women who have fallen whether on or off stage, I believe that to this example of 
mine, I have shown courage and strength of being a woman, of being who I am. And I hope to be a good example to the rest of the women in the world. Thank you. Thank you. She has a lot of class, a lot of poise, I think. But Julie, I have to say, she's working that fallen on the stage for dress rehearsal. <laughs> Three delegates who still have a chance to be crowned Miss Universe 99. In random order, Spain! continue as Miss Universe? That's a very difficult uh, situation to be in. And um, I believe that the Miss Universe, if ever she becomes pregnant, I believe that she should continue with her reign if she has been a good example to be a Miss Universe. She has pursued all the, all the goals that she, has, she had in the first place, and I believe that she should continue. Thank you. Philippines. If for any reason the winner cannot fulfill her duties, the first runner-up takes over. Tonight, the first runner-up and winner of a cash scholarship from Oscar de la Renta Swimwear is Philippines, the 1999 Miss Universe. 